Hello, my name is Dan Grant, Haldex Tech Service Rep from Haldex Corporation. For this presentation, we're going to discuss the methods and practices of a Saba automatic brake adjuster. Before we can go on automatic brake adjusters, there's some things you need to know. You need to always do routine visual checks. Also, per the CVSA Level 1 uh, applied stroke measurement of a maximum of 2 inches is always very critical, and that is for a type 30 inch air chamber. Manual brake adjustment can usually hide some given problems within the foundation brake. Also, as we go into the brake components, things that affect brake adjustment are camshaft bushings, return springs, actuators, and drums. And the installation must be within the manufacturer's specification. Brake adjuster control arm, the wear bushings, or attached hardware that demonstrate visual damage uh, causes some problems for the automatic brake adjuster. The main point to remember is automatic brake adjust adjusters must never be operated as a manual adjuster except as necessary to get the vehicle off the road. How we identify uh, an automatic adjuster. Haldex makes two automatic brake adjuster. One, the AA1, and as shown here, it, is, it shows a D-shaped cover. It comes to a point. And the Saba adjuster is a flat plate. And one other uh, point to make here is on the AA1, a majority of those brake adjusters have a pointer and a notch. And on the Saba, there is no pointer or notch. You can also identify whether it's a Saba or an automatic or a, a AA1 adjuster. And in this slide, you can see the part off of the part number. The 409-1, the one represents it's an AA1 adjuster. And the serial number right below it, as the example shows, 33489, that means that this adjuster was built the 334th day of 1989. If you have a Saba automatic brake adjuster, the part number will start out 409-2, and the 2 is representative of <clears throat> the Saba automatic brake adjuster. The date code of the adjuster is the same. The first three digits are the day of the year and the last two is the year. And in this case, 334 days of 1999. For more information, please contact haldex.com.